Dreallday.com. Today's daily motivation is about structuring your life. Now, the reason why I'm giving you this message about structuring your life is because I talk to a lot of people in between e- emails, DMs, you know, text messages, uh, comment replies, tweets, and in person conversations. And I'm often asking people, what's the biggest challenge you're dealing with right now? Or usually, reason I'm communicating with them is because they're dealing with some challenge that they feel like I could possibly help them with. Now, given the angle of my material, I talk a lot about mindset and you know, discipline, confidence, mental toughness, things like that. Often the challenge that people have, one of the challenges at least, is that they want to be more consistent in their work. They want to produce more output and they feel like discipline is the key for them actually having it. And the good news is you're right. That is the key. If you have more discipline, You'll probably produce more output, you will be more consistent, and you'll get more done. And hopefully, assuming that you have a good plan, that will lead to more and better results. Now, here's the challenge with all this, because a lot of people think this, some of you who are watching this think this, the challenge is you still have not been able to do it, even though you have the idea. And I just told you, this is the right idea. So why aren't people doing this? Here's the reason why people are not doing it, because even though you've concluded that the key to your success is that you need to be more disciplined. You don't know how to actually make yourself be more disciplined. And this is the place where a lot of people get stuck. All right. They're like, all right, discipline is the thing that I need, but uh, how do I get disciplined? Right, how do I, do I create discipline? Do I make myself be disciplined? Do I force feed myself discipline? What do I do? Don't do any of those things because this is what a lot of people try. And this is the reason why many people fail at discipline because they are trying to make themselves be something that they're simply not. So let me tell you how to do this in a way that actually works. What you need to do is implement structure. Why? Because structure produces discipline. Structure produces discipline. Think about in your life. If you had a strong uh, parental presence in your life as a kid growing up, your parents' strong presence in life provided structure. And because of their provided structure, you were disciplined in your behavior because you were, you know, you had your parents kind of watching over what you were doing and they were going to hold you accountable for anything that you did that was outside of the bounds of what they, of the parameters that they set for you, right? Also think conversely, if you did not have strong parental presence in your life growing up, then there was very little, and there was very little structure. You conversely didn't have as much discipline simply because you could do whatever you wanted to do and you knew there would be no accountability if you did something that was outside of any bounds, there were no bounds or there were no parameters. So you did whatever you wanted. Let's take another example that everyone can relate to. I don't know what your home situation was like, but all of you went to school, right? At least elementary school. You were in third grade and teacher wasn't there that day. And the substitute teacher came in the room. Generally, what did that mean? That meant that the classroom was going to be a zoo that day and it'd be a big party. Why? Because the main teacher represented structure that you knew you had to follow. And if the main teacher is not there, that means there's no structure. Therefore, you can do whatever you want. And as a third grader, you probably just play around and goof off for a good percentage of that day because there was no structure in place. But as soon as the main teacher came back to school the next day, they got over their their illness. Now, all of a sudden, the structure's there. All of a sudden, you were disciplined again, just, just like that, that fast. Now, did you all of a sudden just become a disciplined person? No. Only thing that happened was a structure was put in place or the structure was re uh, re installed let's just say for lack of a better term all of a sudden your discipline was back so what you need to do folks you want to be more disciplined is you need to put structure into your life and putting structure into your life means it needs to be organization needs to be clear plans need to be clear parameters need to be clear accountability and you need to know exactly what you are doing exactly what you're not doing now you may be wondering okay dread that all sounds good but i don't even know how to do that all right so what do i do with that let me tell you what to do number one easiest thing any of you can do is open up your calendar, wherever it is, whether it's on your phone, whether you have a desktop calendar, if you don't own a calendar, go get one, go get it from the local grocery store or use a calendar app on your phone, which you can get plenty of them for free. There's thousands of them out there on the app store and start scheduling your day. That's the simplest way you can create structure. You can put structure in your life right now for free by using a calendar. Everyone can do that. Now, as far as any other structure, based on what you're doing in life and where you're trying to go, you need to go find someone who is already doing and going in the direction where you want to go, look at what structures they're using, whether they are sharing it with you openly, whether they have it for sale, whether you got to sign up for it, whatever it is, you need to get it. That's it. 
go get it. I don't care if it's for sale. You got to you spend your money, spend your money and get it. If they're giving it away for free, you just got to do all the work that they tell you to do, do the work. Whatever it is you need to do to get access to that structure, go get it. Why? Because the structure that you implement in your life will produce the discipline that you want and need in your life. That's the way that it works. If you don't have structure, you will not have discipline. With no discipline, you have no performance, no performance, no rewards, no rewards. You don't get what you want in life, and then you end up being like most people. And most people, by definition, are average. The question is, what do you want? So with that said, leave a comment in this video. Let me know the best action step you took based on what you heard here in today's Daily Motivation. Secondly, Daily Motivation text is back out. If you just text me at my number, 305-384-6894, you got two options. You can get the Monday Motivation for free, or you can register to get the Daily Motivation. It's two bucks a month. Yes, two dollars a month to get the Daily Motivation every single day. Right, so do the math on that. It's like seven cents a day. So you can sign up for Daily Motivation if you want it, or you can get the Monday Motivation for free. Either way, just text me so you're in my text community. Again, the number is 305-384-6894. It's free to just get the Monday motivation. Third, make sure you go to workonyourgameuniversity.com. That is where I offer all of my coaching. That's the only place that I work with anyone directly. If you want to get access to our best trainings, courses, and everything else we're doing in the university, it's all at workonyourgameuniversity.com. That link's down below as well. And while you're here, do all the YouTube stuff, which is subscribe, hit the notification bell, like the video, and share the link to this video to, with someone who needs to hear this message because it's more than just you who needs to hear this. So share this with somebody who needs it. Work on your game. Dre, all.